it won't be Grand Prix final participation that Jimmy Matt is looking for. He was ninth last week in Chongqing in China, but hoping to have a short program skate that is reflective of what he's been doing in practice. He said that he felt good in the practices in China, just as they do back home where he trains in Boston. He needs to put mentally everything together to deliver the speculation of the judges. Skating to the music, Hernando's hideaway, such a brilliant entertainer. First quad toe of the event. Next element is the triple axe. He had a fall on this seven days ago. And just a hand down today. Jimmy Ma from the United States of America completes his short program. More successful than seven days ago in Chongqing in China. Perhaps a little bit more focused, less of a performance than what he delivered in China, where he just oozed the swagger that we saw at the very start of this program, but perhaps conserving a little bit of that emotional output and performance, make it through to a uh, triple axle that he stood up on rather than the fall that he had in his first Grand Prix assignment of the season. Alexei Litov, coach with him here, was coach Olga that was with him in China. And the beginning of the program is just such fun. It's what a skater has the bravery to shake the backside of the judges. That said, perfectly appropriate to the music as we see the quad toe. And he did the quad toe triple toe last week, elected to put the combination intentionally or not. On this, the second jumping pass, the Lutz. Tighten his knee, but clings on. I think it's time to blow this scene, get everybody in the stuff together. Okay, three, two, one, it's jam. Such a fun performer.
And although he had that mistake on the triple axel last week, his short program score there was his season's best of 77.29. Triple axel here, hand down, still a minus GOE, but not as penalizing as the fall. So will he be able to push over the 80 point marker and in turn keep Kushiro Shimada, the first Japanese contestant at bay. Does that, 80.19, doesn't look overjoyed, but grateful to see himself in first place. And Jimmy Matt will be in the top group for the free skate tomorrow.